So I finally decided to make a sniper tutorial for Arma 2. This isn't going to be the best way to calculate range, but this is how I do it. I'm sure you can find many other tutorials where you'll be able to calculate it faster or you can download programs on your phone, but this is just how I do it. So without further ado, let's go ahead and place down a target. Okay, so I've placed down a target, and I'm just going to quickly range them with my self lamp. You always want to range them at their feet, because you see if you aim at their body, it gives you an inaccurate range. Uh, it's saying 1400 here, but if I aim at his foot on the ground he's standing on, you can see how it says 825. We're going to take the distance divided by the muzzle velocity of the round for the uh, 50 BMG I know that the muzzle velocity is 887 meters per second so we're going to divide 825 by 887 also you're going to need to put 825 meters into your scope so let me just quickly find that number. Okay, so for the 50 BMG at 825 meters, you will need 11.44 MOA. So you always round up, so we'll just do 11.5. And you're going to need a Kestrel 4500. And basically, all you need to do to find the windage is press the center button, press the left button, and it'll tell you the crosswind. So it's a very, very low crosswind right now. When you have numbers higher than 0.5, you really need to consider that. So what you're going to do is you're going to take the number you got by dividing the distance divided by muzzle velocity times the number you get in the Kestrel. So I got 0 0.930. You're going to multiply that by 0 0.08. And it's pretty much inconsequential. So you always round to the nearest number. So I'm just going to keep it at 0 MOA. If I fire at this target, he should die first shot. There you go. Pretty easy, as you can see. This also works at extreme distances, so as long as you're accurate with your calculation, you should be right on target. Okay, so I've placed down three more targets. Let me quickly range them. They are about 1,925 meters away. And if we do the same steps that we did last time, we should be able to take them out pretty quickly. 1925 divided by 887. We're going to take that number. Sorry, we're going to take that number, multiply it by the windage. Okay, that goes out to 0.69, so we're going to round up to 0.7. If we do shift K, we can get a windage. Go opposite of the windage. So I pressed right to go positive MOA. If it was to the uh, if it was blowing towards the right, I would go left. And it's 84. I fire, I should hit. Yeah. With the windage, it could be a little bit off. Nope, first shot hit. Hit. And hit. 3 for 3 at almost 2 kilometers. If you found this tutorial helpful, 
consider subscribing. Also, if you could leave a rating, that would really help me out a lot. I'm going to be making more Arma videos. I've been taking a break. I lost a lot of motivation recently, but I'm getting back into it. That's it. Thank you for watching, and I'll see you next time.